YouTube what is up I am back with the brand new video now here today I'm gonna be discussing some of the recent pieces that I've caught from the most recent revenge drop and these pieces being the nine months of suffering I guess that's what they're called nine months of suffering hoodies or tees or whatever I know a lot of people are calling them just bejeweled tees or bejeweled hoodies whatever the case may be but um yeah let's get into it now this drop was the most recent drop I was actually surprised on the pricing of these pieces just due to the fact of these pieces using the rhinestones and everything and that probably taking a lot more time to manufacture than screen printing so um with that being said um the actual prices on like the hoodies were shocking to me because I was expecting 148 I was expecting them to just go all out and everything and kind of upsell us but they didn't the price I think was 88 or something like that it was just the regular hoodie price and I was just actually shocked by that and a lot of other people were and I want to say that was a great thing that Revenge is dead done and I do you know I applaud them on that for getting the pricing rate right on that I think that that's really dope and <clears throat> For, for what you're like spinning, it's definitely a sick piece. And if you're thinking about like buying this piece for resale or or anything like that, just buying it secondhand, I would definitely say go for it. You will not be disappointed in either the tee or the hoodie. Now here, I'm gonna be showing the tee first. Now the t-shirt doesn't have any screen printing on it. It's just mainly just the jewels. Now the jewels that they used for the red tee were white stones and black stones and I really think, think that that design overall is just really nice and it's super clean. So I wanted to get a red tee but I definitely didn't want to miss out on that black and purple. And I wish that they would have put something on the back of the tees. They did not. Of course, the tees are a blank, which I think that's kind of cool. It's kind of like a subtle piece. It's like, I'm not trying to do too much. It's just like something on the front. It's just something chill I can layer with or something. And then we have, of course, the other piece, which is the hoodie. Now, the hoodie had a lot more work done with it far as like the overall design of course you see here that we have printing going on with it, screen printing which I don't really think that we needed the screen printing because I actually like the way the T looks by itself with just the revenge and I think that they could have easily done that with this hoodie but it's cool I think that the printing on its own is it's pretty decent it's better than the lightning drip like how they like print it over the pocket it's way better than that and overall it's just a lot cleaner it looked like they took a lot more time with this piece and this is probably going to be one of the best pieces from like this year of revenge before i have to even see anything else i can definitely say that this piece right here is going to be hands down one of these best now now we have revenge on the front of the hoodie and this is above the pocket it's in white and purple stones the back is also in white and purple stones it says it only takes nine months to build a life of suffering now a lot of people will talk about different things about how they feel about the quote and just overall the pizza itself I think the piece itself is super sick. A lot of people would think that they should have just put just the star on the back, which I think that would have been really sick. But I think the quote is cool. Some people think it's them just being too edgy, but I don't think that at all. And I mean, they were just quoting the song lyric. I feel like some people are just like, just way too weird or just trying to be way too hard on them. Which I totally understand. Everyone has their own perspective and their own opinion. But I mean, I've seen a lot of people just agreeing with that fact just to seem like they were cool to be like, oh, it's not cool to be edgy. Oh, I'm so edgy that I'm not edgy. Like, 
these guys on these reddits are just a bunch of posers and shit <laughs> but um man i am super excited about wearing these pieces and i'm just waiting for the perfect time to throw them on now i'm definitely gonna be bringing more revenge content to this channel soon as things develop i'm not sure what's gonna be the next drop but we will see in due time and i want to say thank you for checking out the channel thank you for stopping by and don't forget to comment like subscribe hit me up with any questions and like i said if you're thinking about buying the second hand you can buy it at places like grilled depop ebay places like that just second hand or instagram i would suggest you go through a marketplace or have them do it through a paypal invoice if you're going to be doing anything off of a site just to be safe and to protect yourself and like i said thank you for stopping by peace out